First of all, guys, how are you all feeling? Good. Good. Hi. Decent. Yeah. How have you been? Um, how have you been handling the stay at home and the homeschooling? Uh, it's uh, what? Oh, am I supposed to be? How is it? Has it been okay? Yeah. Okay. So I think that um, from my perspective, um, just thinking about you guys, and I've spoken to a couple of parents as well. I think that um, you guys are in front of a computer all day. Is that right? Yeah. 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 So the last thing you want to do probably is do another Zoom meeting with me. Um, so what I'm going to do um, today is just give you guys some tools uh, to, to train on your own. But it'll be just a, I want you to do it twice a week for this week and then we'll make a progression for next week. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yep. It's pretty, and I'm just going to walk you through it today. Um, and then the other guys, when they see the recording, they can then, um, you know, do it on their own and then you guys can do it as well. There's a couple of golden nuggets on I'll walk you through it, okay? Here comes Owen. G'day, Owen. Owen, please. How are you, buddy? G'day, Hello. Owen. Hello. How are you, bud? Hey. Turn your screen on for me if you can. Okay. Cool. Uh, I have to... So all I was, uh, all I was, uh, Owen, I was just telling the crew that um, I've got a, I've got a good strength and conditioning plan for you. Just a, just a, an entry point, not an entry point one. It's actually can be as demanding as you want, or as, um, uh, as easy as you want without any equipment. So um, I've got four exercises I want you to do, and you can do those in a um, circuit fashion. I've got it written on the board here as well, as well as an ab protocol, a midline protocol to do. And then I've also got some sprint conditioning for you to do. Um, okay. And it's in a 300 meter shuttle. You can do it outside. Now, I, I know that Landon and Caden and, even, and Chase, they've been linking into a couple of my Zoom um, workouts that I've been doing in the morning and afternoon on Beak Athletics. You guys are more than welcome to join into those. They're really they're good fun. I worked out this morning. I work out every morning with the group at 9.30. They're just conditioning workouts and all you need is a dumbbell. If you haven't got a dumbbell, you can just fill up a backpack full of sand and or uh, bottles of water and just do an odd object conditioning workout with it. Does that make sense? Okay. Yeah. So whatever the case, I'm going to talk to you about your particular workout and then we'll just walk through it. We don't have to do the workout today, but I want you guys to understand how to do it, okay? Okay. This, this okay. Is how we're going to go. Can everyone see the board? Yeah. No. No. What? Okay. So I'm going to walk you through the four, the four exercises, okay? Well, how did you do that? You see it? Yes. Awesome. Let me screenshot that. I'll, I'll put it in the list. I'll write it out for you guys. I don't know what it is anyway. Oh, okay. So. The key component of this, guys, is the first exercise. It's a really hard exercise to do with load and weight. But ideally, you want to, we want to build you up to make the, your, your legs, your glutes, and your hammies, and your quads just super, super strong. We're doing this, the Bulgarian split squat, which is essentially um, with your back foot on a, on a bench, or a, a riser, I've got a box here, is the king of single leg strength. And if you can improve your single leg strength, your squats are going to be easy under a barbell. They're going to be a lot easier, okay? Does it make sense? It's a very demanding protocol, though, on um, hip stability and trunk stability. So it's just, uh, it should be done only twice a week. So we'll do it today or tomorrow and three days apart, okay? Make sure it's seven, at least 72 hours apart. Even though you guys okay. are going and you recover very, very quickly, um, I just want you to focus on doing it properly, okay? Um, so there's a Bulgarian split squat, and then there's push-ups as a second exercise. That can also be done as 
dumbbell bench press. Um, you can put a plate on your back. You put a ba bag on your back to make it heavier. But the idea on the push-ups um, is that it's an AMRAP. We're doing three sets of these four exercises, okay? AMRAP means as many reps as you can do. Um, third exercise is glute bridges or glute raises. Excellent for the glutes and hamstrings. We do it on the stability ball. If you've got a stability ball, we use it. If you haven't, we'll just use that same elevated surface, the bench or the box. And the fourth exercise is a one-arm dumbbell row. You can also do um, backpack rows, right? Heavy, load your backpack up. Boom, you can go like that. Um, you can do it with one arm if you want or two arms. Also, if you've got a pull-up bar, who's got a pull-up bar at home? No one? Okay, so we'll leave that out there. So we're just, basically we're doing some single leg work, upper body pushing. We're gonna focus on the glutes and the hamstrings, posterior chain, and upper body pulling. We do it in the gym all the time, okay? Make sense? Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Then we're gonna do a Tabata Superman and a banana or hollow hold um, plank. It's just gonna be stationary ab work. Um, my abs are absolutely crushed from the last few days of working out, but um, been working my abs every day and it's been great. So if you do tap into the um, our workouts in the morning and night um, on the BK Athletic Zoom, and I'll, I'll, I'll tip you into that. Um, we do a lot of ab workouts in that as well. But anyway, Tabata is 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. So you're gonna do a Superman, which laying down on your flat front for, for 20 seconds with a 10 second hold, a recovery, and you do it again. You're gonna do four sets of the Superman and four sets of the, um, the hollow hold. I'll show you how to do that. Then the conditioning. It's a, it's a um, every three minutes times three to four sets, you are gonna set up a 300 meter course. So a 25 yard shuttle sprint just outside on the road uh, or on your pavement or on the grass. Um, so 25 yards, you guys know how to measure that somewhat? No. So 25 yards would be uh, about 12 meters. My advice is this, one meter is about one full stride, okay? So just take, take 12 long strides out, that's about, no, do, do 10. 10 long strides, that's about 30 feet. Yeah, that's about right, about three feet per meter, 10 meters, okay? So nine or 10 strides, do 10, okay? Long strides, put one cone down, another cone down, and you're just gonna go three, two, one, go. You're gonna sprint, come up, touch the cone with the right left hand, or a water bottle or something, touch it, and you're gonna turn with your left foot, you're gonna sprint to the other one. You're gonna touch it, with your, touch with your right hand, and sprint back. So you're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six. Boom, it's gonna take you anywhere between 55 seconds and a minute 15. You're then gonna walk, rest, and recover to the three minute mark, okay? So you've got about, it's a one to two work rest ratio. So you should be recovered enough you know, to do that again. And I want you to do it. You're gonna do three sets or four sets. Now, the reason why it's three or four, I want you guys, you want you to time yourself. And if you only, if you do it in say 65 seconds the first time, and then 67 seconds the th second time, and then 68 seconds the third time, I want you to do your fourth set. If you do it like this, if you go 65, 70 seconds, and then 73, you're done, okay? So that's the game I want you to play. There's like a five second window from the first set to the third set that I don't want you to waver from. And if you do, just call it, okay? But if you're, if you're on point and you pace yourself well, even though I want you to sprint hard, um, do the fourth set. Does that make sense? Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Okay. So let's just go through. Oh, the golden nugget, though, back to the strength training. 
is all four movements are to be done at three second tempo. So it's going to be one one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand up. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand on all four exercises. If you break the tempo, just call your set and make note of it on how many you've done. Okay, this is a great way to improve your strength just doing body weight training. There's no point you're just going up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Okay, we're looking to get time under tension and let your muscles um, get blood in them and they will grow and evolve from that. Granted, you're eating well and uh, drinking your water and eating your protein for breakfast, right? Uh, Are we all doing that? Yes. Uh, awesome. Yeah. Good stuff. Okay, enough talking. Let's just go through the protocol. So I'm going to walk you through. If you guys could get, if you guys could get just like a box or something to... To utilize, Landon, Caden, can you guys get up? <laughs> there we go. I want to walk. So, have you guys got like something to, to put your foot on? Okay. Uh, 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 chair work? We have a step ladder. Wait, can a chair work? My chair. Yeah, yeah, definitely a chair would work. This okay. one. Yep. I got a chair. Awesome. Cool. So some of they're just, oh, you, can, you can be relatively stable on. There you go, Kate. Cool. Something ideally, guys, around uh, knee height level, okay? This is a little bit small for me. Okay, just watch me first, and I'll watch you. So I'm going to be sort of set like so, and I'll walk myself three paces out. I'll jump on. Can I get can I get how do we do it? Wait, how do we do it? How do you do what? Wait. It keeps like changing the camera. Wait, no, like, no, like just put your toe on it. Okay. That's not hard. No, put oh. your how on the edge. Yeah. So put it like that, and then put this to the left of it. Then put no, put your foot further left. Okay, Other you guys. Just for now, can I have you just, I think it'd be best if you guys can get on, um, hey, Selena. What? Selena just jumped on. Um, <laughs> so, um, Owen. Yeah? I want to be able to see you guys, right? So I want to see your whole body and your legs. Yeah, okay, I'll try. <laughs> no, I not Just put it on the floor. Put your phone on the floor. Uh, wait, yeah, I'm trying to get the right angle. It's just, it's so weird. There you go. That's better. Yeah, like that. I got to put something behind it though. Done speaking. There you go. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. So let's just get your, your back of your foot on the bench. Okay, and I want you, so I'll show you again. So I'm like this. You got it? Let's go. Put your back of your foot on the bench. Owen, what are you yeah. doing, buddy? Owen. Uh, it keeps, it gotta, keeps chasing the camera. It's don't worry about that. Just turn your foot around. Okay. Wait, what? Wait, okay. Hey, Johnny, you got it? Good. Oh. Go for it. Do it, guys. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. Owen, you've got to turn around and face away from the bench, buddy. 
Oh, Alan? okay. You see that? Yeah. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand up. And everyone relax, just stop for a second. Owen, can you pay attention please, mate? I want to show you this. Yeah. So you're going to get yourself, you're going to face away from the box. You're going to go three steps away from it. And then you're going to put the opposite foot on the box, on the bench. What? Okay? And you're going to balance yourself and go super slow down to the floor. Back to the floor. One thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. One thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. Got it? Yeah. Okay, guys. I want you to do eight per leg. Go for it. I'll call you in. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. Apart. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, up. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, up. That's six. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, up. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, up. Change legs. Okay. Good. And. Set one one thousand two one thousand three one thousand up one one thousand two one thousand three one thousand up one one thousand two one thousand three one thousand up one one thousand two one thousand three one thousand up one one thousand two one thousand three one thousand up two more. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, up. One more. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, up. And relax. Okay, you guys feel that? Yeah. So, yeah. on on day one, like I'm okay if you guys, if you can stabilise for eight to ten reps, and you, and you feel like you can do it without kind of being off balance, um, just stay with that for body weight for the first session. But if you feel like you can do those quite comfortably and you do those easily, grab a dumbbell. Caden, Landon, something like that, okay? Next time. Just saying next time. Landon, next time. Straight up on the ground for the next session. Okay. So, guys, second exercise in this protocol is going to be push-ups. Watch me. When you do the push-ups, it's going to be here. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. Okay, let's get ourselves on the floor. Let's get ourselves on the floor. Let's have a look at that. Set. Landon, Caden. Ready? One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, two. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, three. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, four. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, five. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, six. Let's just relax there. Just call it. Cool. What? Okay. Let's just call it. So, what I want you to do when you do the session on your own is that I want you to do as many as you can in that set until you until you can't maintain the tempo. You've got to call yourself in your head, one, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one, or have a clock or a watch right below your face, okay? And make note of how many reps you get per set. It might look like 15 the first set, it might like 12 the second, it might look like 10 the third. But the key component, guys, is your time under tension. So that three seconds per rep, or four with a push-up, imagine that if you do 15 reps, there's 60 seconds of push-ups, right? So just, it's an awesome way to build up strength and size inside your muscles. Make sense? Yes. Yeah. Awesome. Good exercise. Good bridge. You're gonna use your same bench, right? You're gonna be here like this. Two legs, same protocol. Up, 
one one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, up. One one thousand, two one thousand, three one thousand, up. Okay, feels on the bench. Let's go for it. Oh, and you're laying on the ground. What have you been watching, buddy? Come on. Hey, where are you? Guys. Guys, did you watch me? I know, but like, it keeps changing the camera from like one person to another. Okay. It's weird. Okay, this was, everybody, okay. This everybody was, can't. Like, hang on a sec. I want okay. you guys to all do this. Go to the screen, on your screen, top right corner, and you're gonna you're gonna press pin pin my video. Where do you see that? Where is that? Where do you see that? Next to mute, top right corner. It's gonna say you know pin my video. So what my video will start on the screen. No. Oh, no. stop video. No, not stop. Pin. More. It's on the right hand side next to mute. Click on that those three little buttons. Oh. It'll the say more. there's no pin. Raise hand, Sophia. I'll raise my hand. It'll say pin um uh pin speaker. Oh wait, I got it, I got it, I got it. Wait, what is it called? You have to click on the person. Wait, no, that's not working. Never mind, it lied. Oh, <laughs> my God, okay. Oh, maybe click. meeting settings? Guys, no, click on my screen in the right corner. It'll say pin video or pin speaker. Oh, Ben, we're not on computer, so it's uh, different. Okay, try on the phone then. <laughs> meeting settings. Oh. It's not in meeting settings, I don't think. Um. Yeah, okay. Hi guys. No, I don't see it. I'm, I'm kind of a professional. Oh, wait, no, I see it, guys. Wait. You just push it at the top. It's like, it's where the number is. If you press on the screen, it's up where the number is. There's a lock thing, like a padlock. Oh, yeah. Good work, Alan. You got me now? Yeah. Awesome. So, fair, you guys good? Yeah. Sophia? Johnny? You got me? Yeah, got awesome. Okay, let's go back to the glue bridge. So, <laughs> three seconds down. Just like this. Watch me fire. It's me trying to do the opposite way. Give me here. No, the opposite way. Oh, one, one, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. One, one, thousand. Oh. Two, one thousand, three, one thousand. Oh, okay. Awesome. You look good. Thank you. Sophia, let's go. Okay. Okay, your butt kisses the ground, guys. Go all the way down. Come up high. Good. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, up. Can you put your feet on the bench, Sophia? Yes. That's where you yes. want to be, on the bench. Lying down flat on your back. Heels on the bench. You got it, girl. That's it. Now, hands on the ground. Yes. Higher, Sophia. Come up higher. There we go. Up high, boys. <laughs> All you can see is that, yeah. Good. Come down slow. Good. Super slow on the way down. Hopefully, Johnny's doing his tempo. And relax. <laughs> Okay. okay, good guys. So our fourth exercise has um. Have you guys got dumbbells? What? Like what weight? Yeah, I've got dumbbells. I got like, but they're like ten pounds. Yeah. What does Johnny have? Dumbbells. Size. Oh, wait. I gotta run and get them. One second. Okay. Sophia, what sort of dumbbells you got? Johnny's getting 15 pounds on. Oh, 40s in both my posts. One? Is it one dumbbell or two? One. Oh, perfect. What do you got, Johnny? Wait, what? one or two? What size you got, Johnny? Oopsie. Oh, I got a 15. Okay, cool. So. Oh, boy. What happened? 
Okay. That's okay. I know it's I know it's probably super light for you. Some you might want to like for the dumbbell rows. We're just going to be here. Right? Oh. Hand hand on the bench, back flat. Four. Down, two, three. Just go super slow on the return. Okay. Go for it. Landon, you good? Caden, go for a set. Are we, what are we doing? One arm double. Right, I'm back. Oh. So, right here, Owen, because you've got two yeah. hands, just go like this. Boom. All right. Down, two, three. Row. Down, two, three. Good. Pull hard. Down, two, three. And pull. Good. Down, two, three. And pull, down, two, three. Yeah, pull. When you when you row, Owen, don't row it to your chest like this. Think about pulling the elbows back. So your hands are going towards your midline, your rib cage. Okay? And relax, guys. Just relax. Okay? Sophia, Johnny. It's okay. Let's do this. On 15, if those 15 pounds are too light for you guys, then you, yeah. will, just, you will just get, honestly, fill up a backpack, your, your school backpack. Okay. With like, if you've got some sand, um, some salt from that you used to use for the driveway for the snow, fill your backpack with that. You'll get 20 or 30 pounds in your backpack. Load it with like, Johnny, Johnny. Yeah, okay. okay, so you don't we don't have to go and get it now, but if you want to get something heavier than your uh, 15 or 10 pound dumbbells, put those dumbbells in the backpack, put your books in there, just load it up to something heavy and awkward, and you can do one arm rows like that, okay? Okay. All right. Guys, the, the, app, the app protocol, Superman. Start with, right? We're gonna go like this. Let me show you. Put down lower. Okay. Toes pointed, feet together. Up like that. Okay. So I can do that for me. Bring your head down between your shoulders there, Sophia. So when you guys come up, Make sure your head is like between your shoulders. Your chin is down. Okay? Go for it. Feet together. There you go. And relax. Okay. Guys, just stop. Have a look at me again. So this is what I want you to do. Make sure that your feet are tight, your glutes are tight, and your feet are together. Now your hands, you go up like this, like you go like that, okay? With your thumbs up, okay? So you're here like so, push in like that. Okay, be really, really stiff and rigid. Head between the shoulders, go for it. Open up your hands a little bit, Sophia. Excellent. Good. So you're just holding that Superman position. Good. Keep your chin down, Caden, when you do that. Good. And relax. Good. That's the Superman. What you're going to do. I've changed my mind. Before doing, you're going to do 20 seconds of the Superman and a 20 second mark. You're going to roll over on your back and you're going to go straight here. Legs are straight, arms are forward like that. Your belly button's going to be pinned to the floor. I'm pushing down with my fingers, creating as much tension as I can. Toes are pointed and I'm pressing my belly button into the floor. Imagine a banana. Right, but I don't want to be soft like a banana. I want to be a hard banana. Okay, 
What? I'll show you again. Watch me. So I'm here. Quads tight. Glutes tight. Toes pointed. Push your arms down. Hollow hole. Hollow hole. Let's do it. Shane. Okay. Toes pointed. What? Push down, push down. So yeah, push it hard. Johnny, come on. What are you doing? Johnny. Good. Point your toes towards me. Point. Point your toes, everyone. There. Legs are straight. Legs dead straight, Caden. Landon. Legs dead straight. Lock them. And relax. Okay. So it's a tension position, right? So I'm like, I'm not just like soft legs, pointed, stiff, hollow. And I want you to push down. The next progression from that is there and then right out there. But let's just start with the basics first of all. This is, this is the king of foundational core exercises, a static position hold. So if you can maintain that, for 20 seconds doing the Superman, quickly roll over into the banana, and then you're gonna roll back over. So 20 on, 10 off for eight sets. So you're doing Superman 20, rest 10, banana 20, rest 10. Superman 20, rest 10, banana 20, rest 10. Do that four times. Does that make sense? Yeah. It's, yeah. very, it's, it's, it's very simple, but simple isn't easy, guys, done effectively, okay? And just to, just to reiterate, and I know I speak to you about this a lot here in the gym, if you are strong here, around this whole area, glutes, lower back, midline, right? All of this, boom, running, stepping, will be more explosive and dynamic and more powerful, plus you'll have a good physique. So make sure that, don't take that lightly, those planks and the bridges, be really stiff and rigid, because it's the gateway, it's the foundation for you to be strong and explosive with your limbs, okay? Makes sense? Um, yeah. Another analogy is, it's like, it's like, your, your core or midline, imagine it like the spokes of your wheel on your push bike, right? If they're not tight, your bike's going all over the place, right? You're probably gonna crash and hurt yourself. So you want those spokes, spokes tight, so the wheel goes round and round. Nicely, okay? And then guys, after that, like that'll only take that, that, the strength training and the abs, 20, 30 minutes tops, because you're gonna do split squat, rest 30 seconds, push-ups, rest exactly 30 seconds. Glute bridges, rest 30 seconds, and then the one-arm dumbbell rows or a backpack row, rest 30 seconds. You rinse and repeat, do that three times. Take two minutes rest, do your abs circuit, that's four minutes and then get your asses outside and run every three minute sprint. Like you've done a 40 minute workout that's potent, right? And it's not long and boring. It's like Johnny, Johnny and Sophia, you guys got each other to train with. Just try not to laugh at each other, motivate each other. Um, Caden and Landon, you guys are, it's, it's awesome. You got your little brother as well and your mum and dad. So I wanna know your mum and, Dad can help you out. You got a brother over there? And yeah, he wouldn't help me. Okay. Well, mate, I'm here to help you. <laughs> okay. You. So if we can just do that, it looks like, honestly, guys, I don't know, but I just, I'm watching the news just like everyone else. It, it, it there is some encouraging times ahead, I think. And I think that I was, say, I was saying this to my members as well, all the guys that train here when I did a video the other day. It's important just to be strong here because like we're staying at home. 
it could be worse, right? The sun's going to shine tomorrow. Everything's going to improve. And we're going to be back in the gym in a couple of weeks. It looks like it's going to be, from what Trump said today, possibly around uh, he would like to um, get it all good by Easter. So it's a couple more weeks. Um, and I know it's trying, it's boring, and but as long as you stay strong here and focus on good quality nutrition, good just have your protein in the morning for breakfast, practice what we preach in the gym all the time, um, and feel good to start your day, because that's going to help you um, stay acute and aware and also positive and happy. So protein first thing in the morning, let's practice that animal protein. You have the time to make it now. So there's no like, oh, I haven't got time, I'm gonna to go to school. No, you don't. You can get up and make your eggs in the morning, right? There's no excuses. Um, there's just action. And I know you guys can do it. And I'm super proud of you. I love training you guys in the gym here. So I want you to have the tools to, you know, to be successful. But just stay strong between here, guys. All the training you do here in the gym, it's freaking hard. What you're doing at home isn't hard. It's just a matter of like, just stay positive. It is what it is. Everyone's doing it, right? So hopefully um, that makes sense. Um, any questions? No. Awesome. So yeah, um, let's do this. Do it twice a week, that, that workout. I'll post the details to the group um, with the actual training protocol. I'll take a picture of it and also write it up for you. Um, but again, it's just four exercises, all eight to 12 reps, eight to 10 reps, sorry, with a three second lowering tempo. The push ups are an AMRAP set. So go as many as you can to failure. Because when you go back to the push up set, it's going to be about two and a half minutes before you do the set again. So you'll be recovered. Um, and we'll just do this for this week. We'll make a progression from it next week. We'll come back for another chat. Does it make sense? We'll come back and have a chat and see how we're feeling and um, see. Actually, if you could film one of your workouts and your sprints, that'd be great too. Take a video and post it to the group. Because I think that being interactive is also good for us to, to make progress. Make progress, right? Good. Sophia? Yes. Sorry. That's okay. I like it. <laughs> Johnny, how you going, mate? We keep, we're keeping you up? You haven't, wow. fallen, haven't fallen asleep yet? Uh, awesome. Hey, uh, guys, if you need me for anything, I'm here. You have my cell. You can just text me um, privately um, if you like or just share the, share the uh, combo with the group. And... Uh, that's it. Oh, yeah. Well, lastly, I did mention about those workouts, right? So if you want to come into any of the workouts in the morning, I work out at 9 o'clock. I coach the 5.30 class at, at 5.30, um, which is on pretty soon. And uh, that's on every day during the week. On the weekend, it's 9.30 in the morning. Log in. I'd love to see you guys. All you need is a one dumbbell. Um, if you've got a jump rope, jump rope's advised. If not, you can just do line hops. But it's a minimal equipment workout and they're super fun, really hard and um, sometimes hard. Today was more of a grind, but yesterday was really a, a good breathing workout. Um, Landon and Caden did it. How'd you guys like that? Oh, that was hard. <laughs> Challenging. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all good. Okay, so guys, um, that's about it. I'll, uh, I'll see you guys later and thanks for joining us today. Hope you don't. All right. Thank you. Thanks, Ben. Bye, guys.